Hello, P60 here with um, part 9 of Spyro 2. We're still in Summer Forest, as you might remember. Well, you should remember because it was last part. We um, went to the second homeworld called Alton Plains, which is my favorite homeworld. And we learned a new ability to be. We can now climb uh, on ladders. That's right. Uh, well, kind of ladders. It's just a surface that kind of looks like a ladder. But screw it, we can now do that, and we have completed Summer Forest, and we're gonna go back to the level that is right over here. Sunny Beach, and complete that one to 100%. See, we're missing two orbs, everything else we have completed here. So we'll get 1100 treasure once we're done here. We don't want to replay the intro, so screw that. Uh, but you have to do all this crap over again. But I think it's... It'll be pretty fast before. I mean, um, this is not gonna be the entire part. I mean, this thing here. Um, I'm thinking about doing another level. You want to know which level it is? It's the complete opposite of. Well, I think they've had already like climb up here right now and collect some more treasure. Nice. Yeah, uh, but I, as I said, I was starting to say. Um, we're missing ten. I'm gonna do like the complete opposite of this level. I mean, summer forest with sunny beach. Guess which level is coming up. If you guess right, well, you're gonna win a medal. No, you're not, but well, I don't know. Think of something you want and I'll see what I can do about it. Request something, I don't know. First person to do that, well, I'll see what I can do. I just wanna store sparks to full health. Always oh, nice. And now we, we're we almost at the end of the level already. I mean, this is pretty damn fast. I mean, some of the levels are pretty weak. I mean, pretty small, like this one. But for the most part, I think I have to say that the levels are bigger than Inspire 2. Or Inspire 1. <laughs> damn. Um, uh, I think that's the case. Uh, there we go, we've opened up there, but we don't want to go up there. We're gonna go remember this fella here. Hello, young one. There's a chef up at the top of this ladder who wants, who wants to make soup out of the baby turtles. Blah, 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 blah. And we'll go up here. First thing, we're gonna go down here and collect these gems. To have 400 out of 400. We're gonna go back into the water a little later, though. And I'll we'll show you something that hopefully that will work. To make a very good soup. I'm sure they are. Can... If you can catch them, you can uh, try to save them if you like, but I'm feeling awfully hungry. Keep turtles out of the cauldron. I mean, what is that thing? Is that like a... I don't know what the hell he's supposed to be. I guess he's a duck as well. I mean, he looks... Messed up. Alright, so we gotta protect this, like cauldron but I want to call it a pot and it has green stuff in it so yeah it's a pot I think you can flame the turtles yeah you can because that's a lot easier than to charge them because if you charge into the pot you will like bump you know like that so if you recharge flame them but then we can like charge them so you see they bump off pretty I mean free and we yeah and it gives us an orb and guess where where you earn the next one well of course it's right here if you step a little closer, blah blah blah, keep turtles out of soup. What's the difficulty? Like 4 out of 5 on this one, I think. I didn't really pay attention. It does not matter because it isn't that hard. Crap, I should have learned by now. I shouldn't say that. But there, the first one. Just, there we go. I mean, they will bump off like, yeah, like crazy. Sometimes you can like screw yourself over by doing that because they will reappear closer to the cauldron than they were before. Oh damn. No 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 no. There we go. I get I mean pot is nice, but well, they really must have an addiction problem right here. No 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 Ooh crap. Damn. How many are there? I don't remember. Flame one and Save us some time. Damn. It's 
stupid turtles. Get into the water, not the cauldron. Hot. Ooh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No! 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 Damn it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We, I don't think we have to talk to him. We can, yeah, we can just run out and we will retry that. Man, I was messing that up. Let's try again. Don't stress. Just angle yourself up with... Uh, and, well, you should be fine. I mean, angle yourself up with the turtles. No, 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 don't! No! No, not again! Really? Oh, lame! Very lame indeed. This is lame. But I, I promise this is not gonna be an entire part. Because, well, there is already one part that is very, very short. And I want to have a little more, you know, content than that in one part. Dedicate an entire part to just this horsing around here. Getting two orbs and 20 total gems. That's a little weak, I think. Damn. As you see, they're, like, reappeared closer to the pot than they were before. That's annoying. I mean, damn, I'm not... No, 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 not again. No, no... <sighs> oh, Alright, for the fourth time. Yes, I said in the first one this... Well, I should never say it's easy. Should I? Damn it. Did that one go in? Yeah, I think it did. I mean, is that a better fate to get sucked up at I pet that a pipe over there in the water? I mean, some pots or a pipe? Oh well, some drug references there. Pot and you know, there's a giant pipe over there. Boiling. I mean, yeah, you get the idea. I think. Oh crap! Stupid ass turtles! Get into the water. Oh, well, it's going a little better right now, I think. Still won't go in there. Okay. There we go. More there. Will that one go in? No, it's two. There we go. And there we go. And... Will he appear? No, oh, no, 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 I think... That's like the last one, I think. No, there's... Some more. But yeah, they're like, oh crap, this is not good. They're like reappearing very close to the pot right now. Uh, I think this must be the last one. No, what the fu- the Oh, dude, really? No way. No way at all. Oh, shoot. Dude, that was not cool. Not cool at all. <laughs> that was lame. Right, this is taking way longer than expected here. Sorry. You know, I'm a real screw up. No! This is it, I'm gonna make it this time. Hopefully, at least. Can't have so many screw ups in one part, that's not. I mean, that's not a good thing, is it now? That's not a good sign for things to come either. No, I think I, I start a new. Well, this is another recording session as opposed to. I think the two last parts were in the same and the three before were in the same there. But this is a new one. And. Yeah, I started up, started up the save file from the main menu this time and. It said we were 36% done with the entire game. So, I mean, over one quarter is done already in part 9. Uh, it isn't that long. No, 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 no. Is that the last one? 
Yeah, finally. Damn. Yeah, alright, and we get another orb, cancel it out. 24, 3 out of 3. Sunny beach complete. What I'm gonna do down is get down here and think, is it here? Isn't it? Screw it. Alright, but yeah, Sunny Beach is complete, so let's leave it. We don't wanna spend any more time. No, I don't wanna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And as always, you already have this talisman. Yeah, I know. Well, that's why I wanted to exit out before that showed up. So yeah, there we go. Sunny Beach complete, and all the levels in the first homeworld are now officially. No, I didn't want to replace. What? The... Can I. Yeah, start. And we're gonna go back, and as I said, we're gonna go do the complete opposite of Summer Forest and Sunny Beach. And you hopefully you'll know what that is. Wait, can't we go back to... I thought there were some portals over here, but apparently not. Alright, then, so... Now get up. Get up, get up. And get out through the window. And we will go back to Autumn Plains through the portal, portal that is right here. See, we have both the orbs there. We got that in the last part. Autumn Plains. My favorite homeworld. Has the best levels, in my opinion. It's just outstanding. Really great. Really great. And where will we... Yeah, we'll probably start up... No, over here? Wow, I should have took the first one, then. Where, which will uh, let you back out. Well, we can... This will go a little bit faster, I think. Yeah, if we... There we go, finally. If we take the high road. Highway. See the mountains in there in, like, background? Kind of reminds me of, like... What's it called? Magic Crafters, right? Yeah, Magic Crafters. That's probably my favorite homeworld in Spyro 1. It's really nice. But we're aiming for, slow down a bit, we're aiming for that portal over here, which is called Crystal Glacier. Yeah, nice. That should be like a skill point or something. But yeah, as, just, uh, as I said, a complete opposite of Sunny Beach, Crystal Glacier. Background on this one really looks like the background on, uh, what's it called, Frozen Peak in Spyro 3, I think. That is one of my favorite levels in Spyro 3, by the way. Kicks ass. <laughs> yeah, a lot of stomping and like crushing, you know, flattening the enemy or the the I mean the allies in this game. Ouija the Ice Builder. Sure, we'll help that guy. So, is there any gems out here? No, this is like the starting area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And see that giant bone here. We'll, we'll stand on this side. Oh, we'll stand on this. Stand on this side. He will jump up and catapult us over. Nice. Now we get to see some action. Finally. Well, that didn't take too long. These, uh, I don't know what they are. Icemen, I guess. Does that make sense? Well, for them. They have like Rayman hands because they haven't got arms and their hands are like floating. So, yeah. I was so tired right now today. I mean, that was horrible. You wanna know what day it is today? As a recording, not of day, the day this is going up, but this is recorded in pretty great advance, actually. Um, today is 21st of February and this part isn't going up until. 9th of March. Yeah. So it's almost two weeks ahead I'm recording right now. I mean, damn. But yeah, I stayed up and watched the Sony press conference. Uh, you know, the PlayStation press conference, of course. I gotta say, I was impressed. I thought it was amazing. It would have been cool to see the console itself, but it was nice to see some specifications, and it was also very nice to see uh, the control. And I gotta say, the control looks pretty good. 
I mean, I think it looks. I mean, it's a Dual Shock 4. It's basically a Dual Shock, but a little redesigned. It looks more ergonomic. I think it might be. I haven't. You know, it's pretty hard to tell though. But I mean, it looks cool. Nice with touchscreen, I guess. If it's not like, if it's not like, uh, well, I mean, I don't know what the hell. You know the motion control in the PS3 controller, the six axis, which was called from the beginning. I mean, you could, you could always like turn that option off, so it was never required for you to use it. So I mean, I hopefully, I mean, it could work out great to have a touchscreen on the controller, but hopefully it isn't, you know. It's gonna feel forced in the games they decide to put it in. I don't know. Hopefully you know what I mean. Damn, I can't speak because I'm so damn tired. I think I'm gonna go to bed, like, really, really soon. Oh, it's almost like... Well, it's about 8 o'clock right now, but I'm probably gonna go to bed at 9 because, well... I'm really tired. I didn't get to do... I didn't do too good at work today either. I mean, I felt like, uh... It was like... I don't know. Just didn't feel that good. But it's, I guess it's my own fault because I wanted to watch the press conference. But yeah, it was worth it. It only happens, you know, once for a couple of years. So I mean, that's big. Uh, money bags. I like how his shirt. I mean, his jacket is now blue, and his shirt is also bluish. Looks pretty cool. Uh, cry for cross the small feet. Paint red. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Sparrow. Now I can buy that condo in Huracos that I've been wanting for so long. Go ahead and cross the bridge. 200 gems and you can buy a condo in Huracos. I wouldn't want to live in Huracos though. That's a pretty... I don't know. I don't really, I'm not really a big fan of the world. Uh, yeah, this cool bridge here appeared for us. Nice. Wait, how many jet warps? Two. 38 enemies. That's a record. I don't think... I think that's like the most enemies that is featured in one single level in the game. It's gotta be. Nice, not a one up. How many do we have? 21! Damn. Uh, Alright, these guys. Damn. Stop messing it up here. Well, it is pretty easy to avoid their attacks, but I was just foolish or stupid. Probably both. Careless, stupid, foolish, ignorant. I mean, all that dumb stuff. Just dumb in general. No problems. Just hold for a second and they will, like, free the Shaman Tuck or whatever he was called. I think that was it. It's gotta be. That was gotta be. Oh no, you know Croc 2. If you played Croc 2, 2, toe, Croc 2. I mean, that's one of the worst games I've ever played. <laughs> I liked it when when I was younger. I thought it was awesome. Uh, I liked the first one as well. Damn, that was cool. That was like one of the coolest talismans so far. But I mean, the controls in Croc 2 and. Croc 1, they share the same controls, but for some reason, the controls in Croc 2 seems a lot more awkward than the ones in the first one. Which is weird, if you ask me. These guys up here, nothing else. Um, because you thought they would like have perfected them, or not perfected, because they were far from perfect in the first one. But, I mean, to polish them some more at least, because, I mean, damn, it's... It's really frustrating to play croc the croc games, I gotta say. Um, and I have no idea how I was able to beat both of them when I was younger. I think it was like 9, 8, when I beat both of them to 100%. And I've, I've, I've like tried to beat croc 1 kind of recently. It was like impossible. It's not impossible, but it's really annoying. Snow Leopard. Uh, Snow Leopard. Snow Leopard, cool. OSX 10.5 Snow... No, that's 10.6! 10, 10 Damn, I'm stupid. Snow Leopard. There it is! Snow Leopard! So this is where the Apple got that idea from. No, it wasn't. Uh, what, what, yeah, the Croc games, they're ridiculously, ridiculously difficult. At least I think so. They're really, really stupid. 
How do you do this? What, where is that little bastard? Is he... I thought he went up there, but now he seems to be gone. Where is he now? Did he go over here again? There he is. Yeah, he goes to these fishing holes and you gotta fry up a fish. Which he will eat and... Then we'll go to the next hole. Kind of weird that he started with this one. Because this is like the last... Or the one that's closest to his master. Master. Dude, it landed up... Damn, that's glitchy. Huh. <laughs> Alright. Well, not too. Well, it was... Yeah, it was kind of glitchy. I don't think it, the fish is like supposed to go up there. It would be kind of like the same if it had landed up here in the fire. <laughs> On the torch. That was that. Yeah, now he will sit like that and he will follow us. Damn. I mean, that thumping sound when he sits down. I mean, listen. He must be like fat. Because, well, it wouldn't cause such a great thumping sound unless. Well, it is snow, so. Damn. You found George. I'm. I'm so glad he's safe. Well, he doesn't got. He hasn't any hair. I mean, that bone is going right through his skull. That must, like, penetrate his brain. Damn. That's gonna be painful. He. Well, he looks kind of. high. Yeah, he's stone as hell. Alright, and how many gems do we have? 306. We're missing 18 enemies. Where, you might ask? Um, I'll show you real soon. See the map? The level is fairly small. I mean, we're almost at the beginning again. But down here, you see these fellas. They look pretty nasty, don't they? I think they're lice. Aren't they called lice? I think... Yeah, that, we gotta talk to this fella here, and he will say... All right. They are infested with multiplying draclets. It's only a draclets? Of they take over our what the hell is a draclet? I always call them lice. Uh, sure, we'll eliminate the draclets. Flame all draclets use the superfly power up. Sure thing. How? I must have been like from my childhood, I call them lice for some reason. I don't know. That sound? No, no, now it's like, like no point in doing it because I missed one. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, I might catch up to that one. No, 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 no. Because if you leave them be. Oh, no. Well, there's no point at all now. Well, we, I guess we can uh, collect all the treasure in here. Uh, because we have no shot in doing it now. We gotta wait for all of them to respawn. It's a lot easier if you do that. Say that we get, you know, get this one, for instance. I mean, that's totally pointless because he will just respawn once I have killed all the other ones like that are after. 400 out of 400, nice. How many were from the beginning? beginning? Wasn't it like 18 or something? See, now they reappeared over here as well. Maybe there wasn't. Was there only 11? No, 12. So let's try this again, shall we? One. I didn't know what I did that for. I hate this. <laughs> yeah. I know I say it a lot, but there are some tasks in the game which are really, really boring. Uh, this level isn't too fun, uh, to be honest. I mean, two orbs. I really like when you have at least three challenges. How could I miss that one? Well, I guess I... That... Oh, crap. Two more. Well, I gotta make it. One more, and... Voila. Here we go. Saved us all from a grizzly bait, please. Oh yeah. No problem there. 2 out of 2, 26. Damn, this part is long. 
Crystal Glacier complete. We get that silly too. We'll fly. We can't fly harder than this. No way. That is lame. So I guess we'll have to. Wonder if. No, it stops. All right. That's dumb. Well, I guess you see, see we wouldn't fly out of bounds or something. But we'll end the level here, right here. Watch the outro. Outro. <laughs> damn. Why can I talk? I'm. I, I, damn, I, as I said, I'm too tired. I have to end this right now. Because this is not going to get. Sorry about this part. It sucks. Uh, but well, it's too late now. I already recorded. Yeah, that was. I mean, are those like jackass guys or something? I don't know, because it seems like that would be something they would do. 1300. Yeah, and we'll pause as soon as we get into the home world. Spyro is afraid of heights, he's afraid of this height apparently. That is lame! But screw this, this was uh, part 9 and it was the worst one yet, sorry about that. Um, what did we do? We completed... The first home world to 100%. We completed Sunny Beach. We also completed uh, Crystal Glacier, which was the level we just been at. So in the next part, we're gonna do another level. Which one? I haven't really decided yet, but uh, you'll see once we start the next part. Don't worry about that. So stay tuned for Spyro Part 10, Spyro 2 Part 10. Uh, all things PlayStation. Uh, but for now, PlayStation 2 going fine.